Hey Red fan, the deal to sell United seems to be getting even closer to the end. Last week, Manchester United's owners revealed plans to investigate strategic options for the team, yet, with a $4.6 billion valuation, there may not be many interested parties. Hello guys, welcome to Manchester United Hot News. If you faithfully watch over the Reds and don't want to miss any updates on this and other latest news from United, then subscribe now to the channel to receive in the first hand all the fresh news. New investment into the club, a sale, or other activities involving the company will be taken into consideration by the group. If the Glazers, who purchased the team for around one $1.5 billion in 2005, decide to offload the entirety of the 19th most valuable team in the world, tied with the Miami Dolphins, only a few parties have the wealth to make the acquisition, according to Forbes. Manchester United appointed the Rain Group as the exclusive financial advisor on the process, potentially indicating America as a market for a new owner. The Rain Group also advised this year's Chelsea sale to a consortium led by US businessman Todd Burley. Other potential ownership groups, sovereign wealth funds, Manchester City, Newcastle United, and Paris Saint-Germain are all owned by funds. Hey, guys don't forget to leave huge thumbs up to keep getting this kind of update from Manchester United. Billionaire Jim Ratcliffe could be one of the few individuals who could afford the team. He has a net worth of $13 billion and has publicly expressed interest in Manchester United. Ratcliffe previously told the Financial Times he met with the Glazers, who at the time didn't want to sell. He also made a late bid for Chelsea. Amancio Ortega, worth $61.3 billion and owner of the conglomerate behind fashion retailer Zara, is also reportedly interested in the club. So is tech giant Apple. David Beckham is open to talks with potential bidders, as well. The Glazers, who also own the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, have been called on to sell for years. Fans most recently protested what they see as misguided management and a lack of investment in the team and stadium. Have your say, what do you think about this valuation for United? Does it correspond to the expectations or not? And what do you have to say about Glazer's management till now? Do you believe that there was misguided management? Leave your valuable opinion in the comments below because it's very important to the Reds.